Good morning everyone. It is eight o'clock in the morning on a Sunday and I am just about to head off to get ready for my third hunt ride. Super, super excited, but it almost didn't happen and I'm gonna tell you why very soon, but I'm a little bit late. So I'm gonna leave now and tell you why when I get there. See you soon. Okay, so I'm at the yard now and I am rushing to go and get kids in. I'm sure I, I'm not actually late, but massive time freak and have to be super early for everything. So I'm going to get kids in now. So the reasons why this ride very, very almost did not happen and actually only started happening again last night. So I got really poorly at the start of the week and oh, pheasants. I don't think you saw that. Oh, kids is all the way at the back. Yes. Really? Oh, yeah. So I got really poorly, even more poorly than I have been of late. And I wasn't sure if I was going to be able to do it. And I said to myself, look, this is once a year. I can do it. I'm okay. So I pushed through it, even though I look terrible and feel 100% pushing through it and then my chaps break so I'm like right okay need to order a new pair of those order a new pair of those they've come they're snug snug to say the least it took me about 30 minutes oh camera skills are dreadful this morning oh I'm breathing is awful yeah it took me about half an hour to get into my pair of jumpers almost broke the uh, pair of chaps almost broke them wasn't great um and then the last seam to be nailed in the coffin was tra Kiz's trailer was too damaged on the ramp to be able to use. So I sobbed a bit and I was like, oh, it's not going to happen. I've tried, there he is, tried my damned hardest to get this ride to happen, but it's not happening. Luckily enough, the ride is only, don't swerve me, you buddy, is only 10 minutes away from our yard. We are super lucky. So, we are now hacking to meet our company instead of meeting them at the start, which I would have liked to meet them at the start, but... because I'm always early even though I panic about being late I'm never actually late well, I'm pretty much ready to leave for the yard and it's only just after 9 o'clock so I don't think my company have arrived in Bella yet what do you think is grumpy of me? are you grumpy of me? are you grumpy? Hmm? good boy yes so I've got some Pattern band. Okay, I put a couple of plaques in Kiz's. <laughs> Kiz's mane. What? What? Can you show everyone? Oh, no, you don't want to show everyone. Oh, Kiz is embarrassed by his plaques. You're embarrassed by your plaques. They're not that bad. Just to keep them out of the way. It's supposed to be extra hot today. 
These were supposed to be clipped yesterday and wasn't. So he's been getting extra, extra sweaty lately. So I thought patting him up will help that little bit. Yes, what are you doing to me? Pickpocketing. It's not even a pocket there, it's just my hip. My pocket's all the way over there. So, almost ready to set off. I think because it's warm, I'm going to go without this as well and just go t shirt underneath. Yes! Oh, it's exciting! Exciting, he doesn't know what's happening, but you'll be excited when you know. He always looks silly with it, that's four long plaited, but it's too much of it. It looks silly with one plaid because it's like, it sticks up like a unicorn. But, um, yeah, can't have more than one at the front now. You need to put some dinner on your face. Yeah, I'm going to get tacked up in a minute and head down there to see if I can find Liam Merlin. What are you doing? What are you doing? Okay, I've lost a layer. I have decided to take this off because I am boiling already. Haven't even gotten on yet. And I've got to say, the new chaps that I got, I spent half an hour trying to get in them because they are too small, I think. I got the same size as I got in the last pair, but apparently different brands, different sizes, and I had to get these ones because I need next day delivery after my last ones broke at awful timing. So I actually feel like everything's kind of been against me to do this ride. First of all, couldn't find anyone. Yeah, couldn't find anyone to do it with, even though I have a yard full of people that the ride is five minutes away from. But no one wanted to do the ride. And so I've ended up doing it with people that I don't necessarily know, which is fine with me, because I like meeting new people and that sort of, yeah, appeals to me. But, um, but yeah, and with that and then being ill and uh, looking so rough, and then the whole trailer thing, chaps. Yeah, everything has been a little bit against me this time to do this ride. So I really hope that it wasn't a sign and that I am supposed to do it after all. I, I'm going to tack up now, aren't we? I'm going to tack up now. Yes, we're going to tack up now and then I'll probably hand over to GoPro footage. Fingers crossed it all works because I don't have anyone to help me. <laughs> Fingers crossed. I will see you on the GoPro when you go to the end. I'm early guys because I just put a saddle on thought about oh, where's this bridle didn't even get it out still in the tack room that's the reason I have to be very early to everything just falling asleep because I get him ready too early he's got lots of hay and water water hay choosing to stand and chill so all good just waiting for a message to say waiting that waiting for a message from Lee to tell me that he has left the start which means that he'll be about 25 minutes away from me and I have to leave in 10 minutes when he says that so I'm really early as always but I feel like kind of getting ready and going out there now because I'm impatient and I'm ready so I want it going so I have my new Aubrian riding leggings on which mm, I am doing an awful job of showing you. Sorry. See if I can pick it up. I'm not that high. I'm not that high. Beautiful. I really, really, really like them. Really smart. Yeah. Nice sticky bum. Good boy. Yeah, good boy, monkeys. Oh. Okay. Okay. So handsome. So handsome. 
Oh no, I've got your idea early, I'm patient now. I'm going to head off in a minute. My bottle. It's my bottle. Okay, that's me all set. Kiz is all set. Hi so guys, started the ride and my hat cam has decided that it's run out of storage and now I'm trying to figure out how to clear the storage so we can actually get some footage of our ride. It's not happening so far. Uh -huh.
absolutely gutted that I've just done, well, I haven't actually got back to the yard yet, but I've just done most of the hunt ride and I couldn't get my GoPro to work. You had to plug it in to um, delete storage and my head cam did not decide to tell me it was full of storage until we got to the yard and I started my ride. So I'm gutted that I don't have the whole ride of GoPro footage. However, I did meet up with the lovely Lee and Lindsay, I believe his friend was called, and Merlin and Mabel, the two horses, which were lovely. Kiz is trailing back there. Um, unfortunately, didn't get mine to work, but he had his on the entire time and it was working. So he said that he's got little snippets to be able to send me this vlog. I can't believe, second year running, I haven't had a camera. But anyway, enough of the bad bit. I'll be seen. I'll be seen. Yes, enough of the bad bit because I have just had the most amazing ride. Just as good as last year. Absolutely loved it. I didn't do as much jumping because we chose a few of the non-jumping routes but we did at least 20, 20 fences of decent size again so I am over the moon I just could not ask for any more of this lovely lovely horsey who is now, oh we're going this way follow the arrows so because I couldn't start at the start of the ride like everybody else. Um, everybody else was about half an hour into the ride when they met up with me from my yard, which means I've got about half an hour of packing left before I get home. But understandably, kids is tired. So I jumped off and we're walking for a bit and hopefully he'll recoup. He usually does record we will recuperate fairly quickly and then we'll be able to get back on and finish our ride back to the start. Um, again, I seem to be awful with this technology, so maybe YouTube is not, not my forte. But yeah, not only did I not manage to get my hat cam, but also, I paused my Equilab when I was waiting to meet up with friends and I forgot to press play. So it says we've done 22 minutes. Although I spoke to Lee and he said 13 and a half miles, I think he said. Oh, we're stopping again now. Kids is hating the fact that we've left all the horses behind. I was hoping that someone would be doing the ride about this time, but they're not, so. Just me and Kiz. Come on, mate. Come to the home. Go to the home and go. The sun's coming out beautiful. It's been a lovely day, a lovely breeze. Couldn't have asked for more than if my camera would have worked and, yeah, had, had my miles and skipped everything on it for that. But, you know what? The memory is what is there for me and I had the best time and I can't wait till next year so I will probably end this in a minute when it's in a minute we've got a long way back it's actually a long way back so I'm walking the entire thing but yeah catch up soon I guess I am back on board and I just found a lovely couple of riders a mum and a son he only looks about six and jumping everything I'll point it to me as I'm chatting even though the lovely kids has just been 
absolutely incredible. I could not ask for anything more. I thought oh, someone in there so I could get some range. Um, yeah, I tagged along with a couple of other riders because I felt like walking, leading him, was going to take forever. He's is much happier. As soon as I found some other people doing the ride and he just finished the last half an hour off with them, popping a couple of last jumps. I'm knackered, he's knackered, but we're on the home stretch now. We're only five minutes away from home, which I'm very pleased about. I'm super hot, super tired, and need a nice drink. and then get back for a very, very long shower. It was so, so hot and sweet. shall have oh, okay. See you looking at look at the jumps in the um jumping field everyone else had a clinic here today so tired are you tired are you tired so yeah i'm gonna leave you and end the vlog here thank you very much for watching like i say oh she's so handsome apologies that I didn't get the whole head count thing. I would have loved to have three hours worth of head cam footage right now, but I don't. I probably don't even have three minutes worth from lovely Lee's head cam, but anything is, oh my wild hair, anything is better than nothing, isn't it? Thank you for watching everyone. I'm gonna leave you with the gorgeous view of Kiz while he munches. Oh, he deserved it today. I was nearly in tears just because I'm so proud of him. Like, even after leaving Leah, um, Lee and his other friend, he just, yeah, he just got on with it and even popped another eight or nine jumps afterwards just because they were not optional and we were following some more lovely people. Anyway, ending this, so I can go home. Bye-bye all!